We're here with a man who needs no introduction, Marco Matarazzi, a.k.a. Matrix. Uh, the interlegend is going to look back at some of his iconic moments with the black and blue of Inter. Are you, all set? Are you ready, Marco? Sure. Let's go. Let's get going. Okay, now, Marco, this first moment is a, is a goal that every young boy, every girl dreams of scoring. It was against Messina. Now, obviously, you were a defender by trade, but here you transformed yourself into an attacker. Let's watch the goal. Wow. Really nice. Have you seen who touched the ball? Uh, well, I think I know who touched the ball. Too, too many champions. Rekoba, uh, Figo, Ibrahimovic and me. When you start to play football, you dream the goal like, like this one, no? So, I did. A, a dream goal and quite rightly, you should be very proud of that goal. You, sh you should also be very proud, Marco, of the double, as the Italians would say, a doppietta that you scored against Siena in the 2006 2007 season that helped Inter clinch the league title. That day you took a penalty and you had to also retake the penalty that day. That must have been yeah. a bit nerve-wracking for you. Let's yeah. uh, look back at it first and then you can comment. Yeah, well, it was a nice, nice moment. Uh, this is maybe is, uh, the, the most important goal in my life, in Inter life. The other one is the best goal against Messina. Yeah. It was nice. In, uh, in Siena, we, I remember we lost uh, the game the um, one one game before against Roma, yep. we won won the title in this moment, but we cannot. And then when I leave from uh, when I left from uh, my house uh, for the um, one day before to go to to Siena, I spoke. I told to my my kids, yeah. hey guys, don't worry. Tomorrow we will win the title. Don't worry. And that's my, I'm exactly my promise. What and then we did it. Let's continue now, uh, Mark, on your trip down memory lane. You won many league titles, but you also won the Champions League in 2010, that uh, never-to-be-forgotten, unforgettable, legendary treble winning season. You must be, again, immensely so proud to say, I am Marco Materazzi, I am Inter, and I am a Champions League winner. Yes, we won the, the, the treble, no? We were a, a great team, mm -hmm. uh, too many, too many champions <laughs> in that team. And then we arrived in the last month with three finals. And then we need to, to win in a row, step by step, game by game. But we, we won. We have a, a good manager, yep. good teammates, yep. and then we want hit yeah. from our heart. That's, a, that's beautiful words there, uh, Marco. You mentioned what a great team that was, uh, what a great coach uh, you had that season, and your whole experience at Inter. You played alongside and trained alongside some incredible world-class players, from Ronaldo to Zanetti. You also had some world-class coaches. What was it like to train with them and also be coached by these kind of uh, figures in the game, Marco? So, was was a dream. Yeah. Because I, I told to my, um, to my kids, because they play football. And uh, I'm lucky yeah. because I play with uh, too many good players yeah. in the national team in Inter too. Because Ronaldo for me was the, the best mm. ever. Yeah. And then Zanetti, Figo, Vieira, yeah. Ibra, uh, Milito, Eto. I was lucky. Yeah. You trained obviously starting back in 2001. There wasn't the kind of technology that there is uh, today. Technology is playing a massive part and helps the players today and the staff, the coaches, the match analysts as well. Do you think maybe it would have been very helpful to have this kind of technology we have today when you were training? I have been in Pinetina maybe mm. three, four years ago. Yeah. It was different than when I arrived. Now I think it, the football is, uh, is different. Yeah. 20 years ago, yeah, 10 years now. Maybe in two, in two years more. Of course, exactly. We have Lenovo. We have, we have ex <laughs> well said, I love it. No, quite rightly, you're spot on what you're saying, that technology is taking us uh, always uh, towards the future, basically, and making things easier and obviously, as you said, helping us analyse future opponents as well. Marco, we're coming towards the end of our trip down memory lane. It's been some Nerazzurri nostalgia. If you've got one last incredible moment, and it's a, a derby day goal you scored in the 2006-2007 season, a goal that you also 
also then dedicated to your son, David, if I'm not mistaken. Let's yeah, actually it check it out. Would you like to yeah, look at yeah, it? We've got yeah. it on the Lenovo tablet for you if you want uh, as well, Marco. Yes. It was my, my son's birthday. Mm -hmm. It was under my curva. Oh, yeah, wow. Yeah, my fan, no? Yeah, yeah. My, uh, my fan. And then we won. 4-3, yep. because I got a red card. Yeah. <laughs> Without that, maybe we won 5-1, 6-1. Yeah. That's all. We won't talk about the red card, as, because also, as you said, Marco, your goal helped him well, to win 4-3 that day. Yeah, 4-3, but for double yellow card. Yeah. I spoke with the referee. Referee, was my son birthday, yeah. please. No, you cannot. Red card. Okay, no problem. The main thing is you scored an into one. 4-3 that day in that derby. Marco, we've come to the end of our trip down memory lane. Thank you so much uh, for joining us. I want to ask you if you had a, a good time and if you have a message for the fans. Thank you for giving me the opportunity to stay here with you, with, uh, with Inter, with the Lenovo. And uh, so, Forza Inter, sempre.